Everybody, Stoddard here with the champions of the Highlander Signature Summit 4610C and 2509A. I'm here with Declan and Brad. We're going to be talking about this huge win so far. Declan, i got to ask you, you know, you were at the Mall of America event, didn't make playoffs uh, for this well, too. Now you're champions here and going to the World Championship. How's it feeling for you? It's feeling great. I'm really excited to win. Um, yeah, it was a really, really tough match. We made some, we were very close in some areas, but we ended up pulling up um, and we won. So, What was your biggest improvement from MOA coming into here? I think our wall stakes at MOA, we didn't even score a single disc on wall stakes, but we, we switched to a new design, really emphasized high rate of speed and really easy to, add, um, to score and power, uh, like really far reach, and we were able to score a lot of discs. And why, uh, looking at Plus, why was Blue Wave such a great choice for your Alliance? Uh, because we looked at their matches and they had really consistent autos and they knew how to hold, hold corner. Um, and so while we were scoring, they held corner really, really well and it worked really well. Brad, I want to ask you about coming into playoff matches here. Like, what was your line strategy coming in? You know, your team just absolutely just rising up all the way through every single match. What was the general strategy for you? I mean, the general strategy was to uh, focus on positive corners. And also because we have a really strong neutral stake, we could take advantage of that and get the top rings by scoring onto the neutral stake. Going through round of 16 all the way up into the finals, did that strategy really change at all for you depending on who you're playing or was it pretty consistent for you? It was pretty consistent. We, we just went for positive corners, defended them, and if we had the chance, we could go get a neutral stake every so often. In, in your opinion, why did your two teams work together so well? I mean, um, because auto, uh, we want all the autos in every match and auto is like a main determining factor for like which team wins. So I think that was the biggest thing that worked well for both of us. Yeah, looking at finals, right, uh, taking autos pretty much every time. Now, unfortunately, finals one had that DQ on that. How did you approach finals one going into finals two? Like, obviously, it's not a great feeling right away, but how did you just carry yourselves and continue your success all the way through in the finals two? Well, we knew that if it wasn't the DQ, we would have won the first match anyway. And so we were like, we can beat them. Um, we know that if we do the same strategy that we did, um, where uh, we get the three mogos really quickly, um, then we're able to, to outscore them, and that's what we end up doing. I want to ask you about Final Three as well, too. You know, obviously you got that momentum going in. Did anything change it for you in Final Three? No, we really stuck to the same strategy of getting the two mogos first, and then getting the third mogo, um, and doing neutral stakes if we can. So last year you qualified for uh, your state championship, right? Didn't quite make it to the Worlds. Now you're going to the Worlds this yeah. year. How are you feeling after this? I mean, it's really amazing because this is actually our first award of like ever for our team. So it's so great that it's the um, ticket to the World Championship. Well, best of luck to you. We'll see you at Worlds. This once again is your champions of the Highlander Signature Summit event. Congratulations, everybody. This video on fun is brought to you by viewers like you and also in partnership with the following. The Robotics Education and Competition Foundation provides fantastic programs for students from elementary school all the way through college. These include VEX, Aerial Drone Competition, Online Challenges, JROTC, Girl Powered, Scholarships, Certifications, and so much more. To discover these exciting opportunities, visit recf.org and get connected.